So first of all, I want to talk about welfare. Big, some of the big issues are mental health, physical health, and sexual health. It's quite good to compartmentalise them into that. With mental health, I want to break the stigma and acid around mental health. I want to encourage disclosure to the disabilities team and additional needs unit so they can help people get the grades they deserve. Because additional needs are quite stigmatised to some people and we don't want to disclose. And that shouldn't be happening at the university. Um, I also want to promote mental wellbeing and self-care. I've been involved with charities and loads of mental well-being like societies and stuff, and LGBT and stuff, and I've done loads of work in this area. Physical health, I want to address sexual assault on campus, because it's an issue that isn't spoken about, and we all know it happens. And if you haven't met someone that it's happened to, you're lucky. Because that's all I need to say about that. And we need to fight discrimination by making people know the procedures that are already in place, like the third party in Port Centre and the Ark and stuff like that. Um, in terms of sexual health, um, feminine, hygiene product, um, and feminine hygiene health and stuff, I want um, feminine hygiene products for free or reduced in a union, and I want free condoms more widely available than they already are. I want mini accommodations and the toilets around campus, because people don't want to come to the little dingy office we're in at the moment and be like, can I get some condoms please? It's a lot easier than they're discreet, you know what I mean? So I also want to work with the other officers to represent the voices of more varied students, LGBT, disabled students, female students, minority ethnic students, etc. post-grad part-time. And I want to encourage engagement by non alcoholic events and actually reaching out to these groups who don't get involved at the moment. Thank you, Rob Shelley. <laughs>